Let's talk about Moto Guzzi. We say Moto Guzzi, but they say Moto Guzzi. I know, it sounds so dumb. California, 1400. This thing is a beast. You ride a Moto Guzzi because you're different. Because you want a bike that no one else has because no one else bought one because there's no Moto Guzzi dealerships anywhere that anyone can find. Except there's like one in New Orleans. Now they're around, I don't know where they're at, but actually a lot of the uh, Moto Guzzi and Vespa and uh, Prilia oftentimes share the same rooftop. It's pretty cool, it's actually telling me how many miles I have till empty, which I'm glad it's telling me that because I'm getting pretty low. And apparently you have to warm it up a little bit before you hit over 4,500 RPMs. Or it just says, nope, not happening. It's an incredibly smooth power band. Like, I, I, it blows my mind away how smooth it is. It's nuts. I mean, you can still feel the vibration, but it's a very soft, soft, light, and smooth vibration. I guess it's because it's moving more like this. Because it's not... When you ride like a BMW with like the horizontal boxer engine, it's really battling itself and it's going this way. But this is kind of going like this and it's kind of balancing it out a little bit, except you can still feel it. When Harleys vibrate, they're just a little more painful. It's not as soft, but this is just incredibly soft. It's a great feeling. I mean, this thing's got real good power. bike handles itself very well and it's got such a cool look to it also 